know, come on, Mr. Boy, I'll jam. I forget nothing less than a lifetime achievement award in contribution to this community and global reggae. Because sometimes I watch all them are playing and I say to myself, you know, so all them is one of the greatest reggae guitarists from Brooklyn. Yeah. For real, for real. Yo, yo, yo. One night, the see the one, others are playing. Most of the guitar when I'm back, I use the mouth and I play. The amount of people call me from out of state. That's your own brother there. Oh, I'm so wicked. Listen, I am a young man from Revolution. So when I try to show people, say, the amount of talent we will have right now, so it's normal. And at the time now, who wants to see the eye them make some money? White people now. White people are playing reggae music. I mean, I want the island to say, I joke thing. Alright. Here we want to see the my community. We want to see the reggae. The reggae, the instrumentalists, them come together. And then said to, like, oh, we have Kalila Rose, we have Lion Nelta, and so we have a farm, a team, vice, and instrument. Too much time is a DJ. I mean, I do make about too much time is a DJ come and get all twenty thousand dollars. And you know me see the whole of the writer so could pay thirty dollar like Carolina wrote down no good lyrics. Don't want to pay a five dollar for what you are and to me I can start writing some people then. Eh? If the lyrics they may have put out over here you no know, attract one and one, me I can start going at some deep serious metaphysics and draw some dopey and some spirit and all them things that invoke certain energy. Yeah, because I know the dopey them I can bring out millions. You understand me? So I'm going to tap in on them and say, listen to me. Boom, boom, bang, 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 bang. So I want to know, I want to see more of the arts that I drive, like the cow them love, Benz, Dima. I don't love to drive no more. From my eye, a acop. You know, me just get a chauffeur. Well, that's a diva. And so we have moved, you know? And so we have to cut it. So, as I said, I know more I say to everybody, man. I'm going to start doing you know, the award in my house. The camera, that, that far, I have a camera, I have to pull on your camera when your time coming up. Yeah. So, Ethan, go and play some music, and I'll come back. And then we are going to do what we have to do. And thank you again. Mm. I got I got refreshment over here. Check out the bar. I'm going to drink a beer. All right. Look at this young lady. Tell me which famous poet is ever. Prasatiba. Well, the sister of Oko Tunura. Yes. The first yes. love poet. And she leave our far, far yard and come and say she's going to receive this lifetime achievement award for our brother. And the fear brother are the first man to kind of turn love poetry. Enough youth throughout the world. We love Mota, we love LKJ, we love Louis Benny, we love Yasos, and we love Takura and all them ones there. We say, Uko. Uko did the art in a different way. And we want to use them for who of us say, when you did the art, and there's something where you play with, because it's a two-edged sword, and it can be weaponized negatively 
I have positively. I mean, I put up on the spot, you know, but I have to make sure they beat them. I can take some picture, please. Because I, I, I need it for the record, you know. Please, take out the camera. You can touch it, you get me nice. All right, good. So she will come up later on, you know, when we call up and say, big up, Oko, and we will talk about him a little bit and so forth. But Margie, we are come from far, you know. We are come from far. It's me, the love I spent away, I go back to the show. I'm really kind of shy, you know. With, we just say a pass, a pass, not 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 road. I had to watch my day. Eighteen, never used to name, you know. Yes, lad, it was a hot. That's a good word. But we see how we grow and we mellow in age. You know, look how old I am, you know. But my tell you, you keep the youthful. I resent the mother so much. My tell you, I resent the mother. You know, that mother was a nice mother, man. My tell you, you're very insolent, man. My tell you, she don't let me know, you know. And the very top man came from Chibubi. I tell you about your brother and your mother, your juice, your mm -hmm. champion. And then I want to hold it up for his team. But when we first said, you know, we just said, you know, you better come. You know, the time came to come. A bump is here? Good. All right, bump in the air. So, well, if the item where you know, really were really like Oko, I left yard and come up here, come check with. You know, see, come check, burn, burn, we have picture, or sergeant your phone. What's sergeant your phone, burn? Soon come. Okay. All right. In there, the back, you know? Are you that? No. That man feel by him, so. You know, my eye is not good like that, you know. What if I him, you know? Rasta look like Rasta. Rasta look like Rasta for two. So, as I said, I feel good. But I want the, 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 the people that come in because you know want I give the thing to man. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm tempted to start giving them, you know. You know what I'm But I don't want to do that yet. I want to pause a little bit until you see some more people. Because you know what I'm saying? What's that? That, 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 that. But it's a tonight. Yeah. The world. I'm going to get something. I'm going to get something really high of fun. Because we're coming together. A Christmas, our power. Christmas, or Kwanzaa, and tomorrow, tomorrow, we there at Omega Evers. So now come over there, I'll be doing performance, dub poetry, Axel Lassie, Burning can't come to, Rasada can't come to, we can't start out Rasada you know, because him the man who was serious about this up, you know. You understand me? So I have an email and look out and I try to wait for him to come. You understand me? They must start. What time tomorrow, Burn? 3 o'clock? I think so, no. They start 3 and we do that perform like around <coughs> 5, 6, six o'clock. So, and all them things there. So, right now, we want to hand them things out, you know. You understand me? Because I see, I want a beautiful lady to come and join me. Right as so. I mean, which lady want to volunteer for to hold them and we shake and we you want to do it? I run for that side then. Want to? Okay, okay, I have a virgin too. I have a virgin. Uh, ah, I see you. <coughs> yes, you are going to get and so line up yourself and so forth and form a beat now. First come up and right hand and shake. Alright. <coughs> we have to go to one of that. So, <coughs> never drink a beer. After we drink a beer, we have a come back. And then we have to go right into it. Martin, I know you have far to go, but I want to see it. You know, I want to see it. Do all the thing, all right? So we're going to send around the... No, I don't want to send around the bucket yet. Because more people will come. I want as much money to go in there as possible. You understand me? So I'm just waiting about half an hour. Drink up the beer. I will move people from the door. You have to get the bucket for me. All right, thank you. So, Kasha, I don't know what happened to Radical Visual Media. I tried to contact her a couple of days, but I don't know what happened. You know, you, 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 you. What happened? Uh, Corona. So, I, I, I don't know what happened, you know, but that's our partner in you know, the whole movement. Maybe she kind of, you know, under the weather. But hopefully you might see her later on. You understand me? Yes. So Ethan, you can't give me a little cuckoo see him when you want to stomp him up. 
Yes, I'm going to Nice to see Sorry, sir. <laughs> so, anyway, you now, Mr. Me we need help with them things, you know. You say, Rasta Tiba, alright, I'm going to help you. So, first, I'm going to wait for my bridging and the bridging take now, I'm going to help now. So, Mr. Bridging, you need to find Mr. Bridging. And he say, okay, sir. And then he say, ah, go through. And ah, pass through. And he say, we need to get them things together. And ask him, all right, no problem. He said, Ak never come check me to them. And no, I'm still the one. I get things together. But we just talk to the gods then. And telepathically. Thank you, this man. Okay. And we have Empress Rootsy in the house. And we have Fan All Star. Okay, well, <laughs> yeah, well, we have, so, Sister Rootsy is going to help Iodine introduce Fan All Star to the globe. You understand me? And my phone now, I'm not ready to start using, somebody have to use my phone for me because some people are looking for me by my phone, you know. So we have, you know, we have special people. We have an invite to come up and read out with the pan the plot. Like our Fuku sister, she can come and step out. Okay, that to that. And then we can ask Rootsy to come up while we are with the fan. And then we know who I will represent. That's why you want to represent that far? Right? No, I cannot. <laughs> okay, alright. And that far will represent you, right? <laughs> alright, now we have a sister here who will definitely do us some honors. So if you want to come and try the mic and I can hear a beautiful voice at the same time now. You can eat and give it up to hear a mic or something because we have enough mic over here now. Hello? Blessed, blessed, blessed God. Yeah. Blessed God. And we all put a lady in the middle, you know? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Make it look good. Make it look good, of course. Put that right side mm. Well. Due to all uh, me yeah. and the spirit them, we always have to wait until Father send uh, some angel. So right now, Father send us an angel. So introduce yourself to them, angel sister. Yes, I'm Angela Selassie, and I'm here to support the movement. And I welcome all who's here, and my friend Kalila, who's been on having seen since Jamaica. So I'm so excited. I'm so happy for all of you who's receiving this award tonight. Okay. All right. So right now, I'm jumping on. I'm jumping on. Okay. Life is an infinite gift. It is often misinterpreted. I was brought into this world of uncertainty, searching, searching for stability, caught up with the twister of life. Adolescence is one of the most tested period of our lives carrying out the full responsibilities of maturity, solving, creating, and planning strategies for our daily existence. It was hard 
The transition was a knockout, a step forward to face that bitter sweet reality. Accepting changes, crossing boundaries, living on the edge. Replacing violence with peace, substituting hatred with love, overcoming fears and phobias. Life is eternal. Life is an infinite gift. <laughs> Mike, why do I have to move so careful as if I am the one doing wicked deeds? And why is this journey so fearful, though I faithfully prostrate down on my knees? While on my energy the pagan feeds, I feel you every step of the pace, being the receiver of my burden. Still the devil is all up in my face. What's with the sway of this deceiver? It's painful he's granted such opportunity to communicate. Through this wonderful race, spread eagle in hate, trying to dictate one's fate. Though we are blessed with your love and mercy and grace, give thanks. You show me them coming. Even though they'll be coming yeah. to disrupt your truth and justice with their lying lips. Carnal mine. Yeah. I saw you coming. I see them too. You tell you show me them running long before they even know they'll be running. From erupted truth and justice. Beyond comprehension to their folly tricks. Carnal soul, I saw you coming. Fearful was I at times tottering until the spirit of truth visited the carnal thoughts because of my uttering. Carnal flesh, I saw you coming. Okay, all right. Somewhere, and uh, should we start with the lifetime achievement awards, or we should leave that for later on? Uh, we could do a safe for who, who are here. Okay, all right. Yeah, get some of the way. Get some of them. Mm -hmm. Thank you. What do you think about that? Yes, this? Great idea. Ah, great idea. Give oh, thanks. Give thanks. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So. We have God willing, right? God willing is one of the youngest dog boy amongst us. All right. You see right now, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, Put your hands together for the youngest dog poet in the house. He will be receiving a certificate of excellence for his contribution to reggae dog poetry. So you can read it out and see what you're getting, you know. So, yes, at Time Ross Productions, certificate of excellence. To hereby granted to God willing, aka Winston B. Franigan, for his contributions to the advancement of global reggae dub poetry, Sarah Vida Masters Award 2019, Masativa founder, AM Time Rasp Production. Mama that teach my good manners. Good night. Thank you. First of all. Yeah, boy, my little hug up too. So, um, when we sit on my side, I'm going to be there to sit on my I'm kind of count and I see much of it. I'm kind of observe what I find. And I said to myself, it's a judge. All right, watch this now. I'm going to cross a Tiba. He seems as an elder and a big brother. Can deal with me as such. And as a black. Man, where uh, the works beyond 
we're not for the basically. You can't just live in day to day life. And, uh, we're big people, you know? You can't live in day to day life and not give a fuck about people. But in taking time and in, in nurture youths, as him say, a conversation with me and him have many years ago, and it resonated in me and grew in me and let me, you know, highlight certain things about my life and change it. I understand, so I have that definite respect the feel. But aside from that, for me that's it, for me to count everybody in here. So we can come amongst each other and say we give each other award and lifetime award and this and that and get a big crowd. We can do that. All the BET and MTV and them up there for doing. We ourselves not be confident in ourselves. If we can say, all right, then we're going to bless ourselves and deal with ourselves as such. No respect, no, they're right, they're so. Like if somebody has to sell them a keep something, you know, do something away, you know? 100% like him say, oh, and pay $30 and $20 for see people are skin out and bend out and all kind of something. But for come on, all of unity and, you know, be with consciousness and positivity. You know, no love no dead. But them can't stop us still because the spirit we're in a way, it's tough. And obviously, we're still there and we're going to continue for there and do your work. I understand. So, my appreciation is more of, when I say, when the brother get the Nobel Peace Prize and refuse it, when them BT and MTV, they want you know, we for us not refuse, not take it, we refuse it, but we forgot they will talk and bash them. And talk about little things like this, so it can become big. So I mean when I talk, it is not so many words. Good night everybody, and we go and enjoy the movement. Give thanks. Yes, big thanks. That good. Shoes, yeah. And uh, as we go in our time and so forth, somebody of all the fire will come for camera. You know? Yeah, big time. Yeah, somebody please go that far come with camera for it, please. It's a very humble man, but we are putting on the spot. Our time bus productions, certificate of excellence, to hereby granted to the Fari Congo for his continued advancement of arts, roots, and culture community service and photography. So we got Master's Award 2019, presented to you by Rasatiba, founder at our time Rasa Productions. <laughs> Just want to say good night to the people. And give thanks, you know. Uh, give thanks to Rasatiba for good night to Sarah Peter and Award. The strength you've been to the community over the years, you know. I give thanks. Yes, I love. 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 Alright. So, we want to carry it overseas now. You see this? Poor Jamaica, oh. And the artist put that to me, all right, no, we don't. <laughs> you might have been a wise words. <laughs> all right. So, Richie Innocent, I met him in about 2016. That's when Sarbita was in Queens. You know, like when we, we, we left Brooklyn one time, right? Yeah, yeah. We were in Queens. <laughs> you know, see, and Richie come up. And we had a theatre, about 20 jumps. Are more and everybody in the house could have pulled a drum and beat and reach a step on stage and then do a poem called Community. You see, they do that poem there. Every one of we have a community, whether Yasso or Jamaica. You see, when the man did that poem there, he said, Jesus and peace. These are the poem where the world wants. Never knew that Richie Innocent was a DJ before him touched that stage. He might tell me, say, at the first time I do poetry. <laughs> and I was astonished because I said, man, bad like that. Me, I tell you. After that, he got team up with a brother at Jamaica named Wise World. And he do a whole party. And then he said, look at me, I said, Chano. 
is reaching a one true youth to the heart. Because they want to see community, in global community, better. So you see right now, without further ado, we are going to invite to the stage no other than Richie Innocent. For his contributions to the advancement of global reggae dub poetry, Tara Beats and Masters Award 2019 from Rasta founder, Our Time Mass Productions. Congratulations. Blessed love for all to see, for the world to see. Yeah, man, for the entire community to see. Can you see this? Yes, we can. Can I hear you? Yes, we can. Can you see this? Yes, we can. Yeah, man, this is very important. This is a very important moment. This is the first time that I have been awarded an award. This is the first time that anything is being passed over to me. And I want to say blessed love to Rasa Tiba, a time Ras production. And just as the poet said before, blessed love, my brother. It is said often time that a king is without honor among his own people and among his own kind and his household. And it is said that Christ was the one who said it. But when Christ said it in that time, he did not say it for it to be perpetuated or for it to be perpetual. And many among us who don't really love to see other people shining and progressing often time use that as an excuse to cover up the negative energy that we often time call bad mind if you are in your community and once you acknowledge and once you can see the greatness among that member in the community you must not be afraid to highlight that person you must not be afraid to mold and shape that person and show that person right across the world. So we say, no excuse to that. And we burn that. King I forget Anna in our own country. Because if you live in your country and you're not Anna the king, who is that king? And if you don't honor that king and that king go elsewhere and he's honored, how do you think you will be look, looked upon? How will you be looked upon if you did not recognize that king among you? So we say, don't make prophecy fulfilled upon you. Don't make prophecy fulfilled upon you. Rasa Tiba, may I honor you for honor me. And just as the poet Bridget said, we're not for wait for a big, big establishment because as Ziggy Marley says, small people one day will get big. And it is said that many are called and few are chosen. You among us tonight are the few and few means that you are great. So I want to give yourself a big round of applause. When you see the multitude appear how much money if we go take in them glorification of violence and sex. No feel no way about that. We know about sex, you know, don't it? Nobody now have to tell me about sex. Cause we know about sex. So all who want to pay them money, if we go watch skin out and broke out and take off panty and dash it down there, so I feel them business that. It means something wrong with them. So them have to go, they go feed the monster within themselves. With a monster diet. And as we say, wise words 
Where are the warriors? The warriors them lose them headlight. Fashion police are look for them because them busy at trying tights. We are the warriors we used to keep watch. Seems like them lights out. Them can't even strike a match. We are the warriors Rafa Tiba. The warriors them drunk. Them busy drinking and not thinking while them surrounding sinking. Who call upon the warriors, man? And if you don't say you're a warrior, and warrior is. Just stand up and I watch nobody. Now watch what them are do. Many, many take a passing. Remember that? The writing up on the wall. So make them party and go on. Just like the great king of Babylon when named Belshazzar. Party and go on. Because Daniel wasn't wise until the writing up on the wall. At the time that they call for the interpretation when they was about to fall. We love this. I'm proud of this. More have to big up my wife. Marvia. Mrs. Robinson. Bless myself. Yeah. More have to bless up my family, my fans, my friends. And more have to bless up a lady with name Mama Ellis Kelly. Yes. One of the biggest radio tracks out of Jamaica and Irene FM, the number one reggae station globally. And this is a lady five years ago that looked at me and said to me, I'm not going to tell you what to do, but whenever time you speak, people listen. And I took her word for it. Two nominations, International Reggae Music and World Music Award. Last year I went to Chicago, performed on the Chicago Music Awards. The first time it was being televised on NBC worldwide. This year I was nominated again among the greats. Yeah? I would say blessings. And as I say, this award is the first time I am collecting something. So guess what? Me I go embrace this. And me I go cherish this. Rasatiba, this is a big embrace from New York, from the space of New York. I'm an honor you, know, respect you, you know. You're a pioneer. You understand? You're a pioneer. And you're not afraid to highlight people. And once you highlight others, you yourself will be highlighted. Once you highlight others, you will be highlighted. So this is a big embrace from you to I and I, and you're embracing all the poets them right now we are rising in Jamaica. We have a poetry mo movement that going right now, more telling in New York. A holy power right now in a Jamaica. Our voice have a heard. And we have a talk, word sound and powerful. Right? So this is an embrace, Rasatiba, from you and your embrace, I and I and the whole of the poets in Jamaica and them are seeing because the record right now. Beautiful. And your embrace Mama Ellie Skelly and your embrace Mama Ellie Skelly Pitney them. Yeah. And she get a day to poets, you know. Yes. It never happened in Jamaica yet. Never. never. It never happened. A top radio personality decide to give a day to poets. And it is called Spoken Word Wednesday. And each Wednesday, everyone in Jamaica tune into Word, Soul, and Power. And I want to give a big round of applause to Mama Ellie Skelly from Brooklyn, New York. Make sure you hear it. Yeah, man. And I want to bless up everyone in the place who are about to call it the awards just like myself. And I want to say congratulations to you. Bless up yourself. And always remember to do good within your community. And the first community begins at your home. Because you have the home, the church, and the school. Once upon a time, if I you never get certain energy at school at home. And then go to school, teachers were respected. And the teachers were willing to train that young that person. Nowadays. When a youth left home and go to school, you have the teacher, they must say, him come, him not come from nowhere. So I be a blame I go on right now, because the teacher say, look at the home where he come from. And I saw it used to go first time. 
When I youth go at church, the music get the order at the church again. Now there has been a breakdown and erosion of morality and values right across within our community. And we keep blaming each other. We have to take collective blame in order to get collective solution. So it takes collective effort. And we have to start. Start as of tonight. Blessed love. Blessed. And you see, what we are doing is to use reggae dog poetry to create bridges. And uh, many times we see that the DJs and the singers them coming out of Jamaica. But now you're going to see a new age, a new set of reggae energy I come out with heal the world and that will come true, the spoken word, the poetry. Yeah, yeah, Mr. Richie Innocent, we love you at Brooklyn, NYC, and whenever you come and you pass through us, Arbiter, you always leave a lasting impression. And tonight, we know it's who's in another house, and while watching globally, we'll remember these words. Community, community, and one more salute for your work. And you deserve, and you deserve this. And go back to Jamaica and go shine your global light in a dog poetry. Ja, love and bless you. Bless you, love. Bless you, love. Bless you. Yes. Mm -hmm. We have we have Axelas on stage. So. I'm going to go for Ak Selassie. We in there. All right. OK. Well, you see, Ak Selassie, I want to do poets them around here with me always say, you're a joke, you know? you are a joke like, you don't know say you're big. You don't know say you're great. You don't know say you can't write. You know, say, and in the park, Rasa Tiba, you know, he's a man, you know, cool man, but the last two years, you see, I get sharp around him, I say, I love that. So, I say to me, say, nah, dead. I'm just dead like some people in my left legacy. So, tonight, we are going to present this brilliant wordsmith, spoken word artist, reggae dog poet, with this. Appreciation to read it out to the world for me. She presents the Certificate of Excellence for its hereby granted to HAQQ Selassie, aka Aquaman, for his contributions to the advancement of global reggae dub poetry. Sarah Beaton's Master's Award 2019, Master Tibor founder, Our Time Rass Productions presents this to you, and it's beautiful. Enough respect. Do give thanks, Angela. One love. It's beautiful. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, humble is the word, you know? Yes. We describe it. As Richie Innocent said, this is my first award, also. Or reward, you know? And we do give thanks to Rasa Tiba. I endorse all the good things that was priorly said about him to the fullest. And I want to say this. The first time I ever went on a stage, I remember I was somewhere around four years young. It was a, a concert. They have this uh, Milo concert in Jamaica. And I went with one of my greatest supporters, my mom. She passed in 2012. Peace be upon her soul. Gloria Louise Buchanan, my inspirator. So on that show now, it was a children's concert. And the poem that I, I did a poem. And the poem that I did was only four line, four sentences, I think. And that poem is as follows. 
Labor for learning before you grow old. Cause learning is better than silver and gold. Silver and gold will vanish away, but a good education will never decay. Yeah, I know everybody. Here. Yeah, so that was the, the vibration, you know? And I remember vividly, vividly the response from the audience, you know? It was wild, you know? It was as if I just scored the winning goal in a soccer match at the final second. It was, it was loud, noise, cheering. It was throaty voices, whistles, and the claps of hands, uncountable. But I remember two hands that were clapping, the two hands of my mom. And the expression on her face made me knew that I did something well. Now, Rasa Tiba, again, I do give thanks, you know. I also want to recognize my sixth grade teacher at Constant Spring All Age School, Miss Wilson. That's the teacher that's responsible for any type of command I have on the English language. Also, she opened me to poetry. After that concert I just described, I left poetry, I wasn't into that, probably 10 or so years after. She was the one that opened me back into poetry with a poem. She teach English and poetry, and she taught us a poem by H.D. Uh, Carberry, Nature. I'm sure most of us know it. And that poem was the poem that opened me back into writing. And I started doing DJ, you know, I used to DJ to Richie. <laughs> You know, I still do, you know, but the poetry is the thing, you know? So we're forward to the original thing, you know? So yeah, and that poet, H.D. Carberry, that did the, the poem, Nature. That, that is a, a poet I want the island to check out also. And we give great thanks to Uku Anora for the work when put in the world road and the way when paved for I and I can even do us right now. Sure. I do give thanks. Rastafari. Yes, yes, yes. yes. And, and as we bubble into time and space, well, burn. Burn it. Cool burn. Okay, all right. Well, we have Burnet Coburn. Come on, Mr. Burnet Coburn, man. All right. You see this man here? Yeah? I tell the man the last time when he was featured here, and Ak, Burn, and myself were standing here, and we were paying tribute to the ladies. <laughs> When me do my peace and checks of wine, <laughs> me have my hat. <laughs> a hat doing peace and peace of hat. Sweet, sweet. Sweet, sweet. When this is when I will be more dramatic, she had it. And no man himself, ooh. That's what we've been waiting for. That's what we've been waiting for. <laughs> me hat just goes so. up. I, I just back off to Rati, Jan. Can't walk in this man's shoes. So you may tell him no. He's an author. And we never mention the rest of things them where the man do. But it's tonight we plan to celebrate him and the world know I see me. Richie McGlad, you have a up on the world something because my phone door at the cinema I'm glad we can up on your page and catch everything we have won. <laughs> so we have burnt in the house tonight. And we are gonna celebrate this brother yap with honors. So they'll step from around me and go over to the lady and make you tell her where I want, no? Right. <laughs> <laughs> right for it. Bless it. Our Time Mass Productions presents to you the Certificate of Excellence to hereby granted to Burnett Coburn for his contributions to the advancement of global reggae and poetry, Sarah Beta Masters Award 2019, 
by Sativa founder, Our Time Rust Productions, presented to you. Blessed. Pan the left. <laughs> you don't get the mic from the right, from the left, but pass it from the left, you know that? On the left one side. Ladies and gentlemen, notice I didn't say men. <laughs> you see, brothers and sisters, sister Angela, final of a meet a long time. I see her spin music all over the world and all that. So, pick up the, and you come give me, you come give me a walk. What? But, when you hear this, me, Get a award at the first award <laughs> <laughs> from the board. And Rasa Tiba, give me? No, when Rasa Tiba said, me I get a award, I'm not saying no, sir. Rasa Tiba, I miss. I'm not giving no award. And then, in the same breath, in the company of man like Richie Innocent, Okunura, Rasmat, Slas. That's a we got up in the team. So, but that's why I say thanks, thanks, thanks. There have been great men and women amongst us. There are great men and women amongst us. And we celebrate each and every one. What you are doing, my brother, is laying a serious cultural cornerstone in the community. Reaching out to Jamaica, reaching out to England, Africa, the motherland, Antarctica, all over the place, the moon and beyond, <laughs> into the celestial realm. I thank you. I thank you. I really, really do thank you. Yes, um, just to take a little bit more to say, um, Sister Margaret in the house has Uko's sister or colleague Uko award on her son. But that's what I don't know, I have to get my little thing up. <laughs> no. We used to stage manage for Uko AK70. So, you see, and from there, I get a word with Uko. We are all the whole time in front of Uko. And we get the stage set up the bench, you know, you know, set up the thing now and see me as a Rasa Tiba, their own Uko. So, in a way, we are Uko Pitney. As much as we are Miss Lou Pitney and HD Carberry from Canada Pitney and all them kind of things. But it's one blessed love. And all I can say is that we shall win because we're in a struggle for our lives. We're in a struggle for liberation. And when me write, me mostly write poem to big up black woman without apology. Straight. You see? Straight. Because a mother of creation, mothers of creation, a them give life and a them sustain the earth. So, me just want to say, me love you know. Yes. Yes. Learn it to go Yes. All right. You see, uh, everybody uh, mention a little thing about Uko. More I mention my little thing about Uko. All right. You see, before me move come to America, you see this logo. Uko was the first man we go to and said, "We want to start a poetry movement," you know. And I say, yeah, I'm going to show you the logo. The logo, the logo never looks so yet. It may be improved, it, you know, but the bamboo was a part of it anyway. In a seat, and then we fly out. Then 20 years after that, we come meet Burn. And then Burn know my uncle. Because my name is Ivy, you know. Ivy is my last name. And then when my final said burn and my uncle used to go to school and then the uku vibration and all them things there. And then you now one day me realize that uku, I still live at Portsmouth, you know, I still live at Portsmouth because the house still there. And we used to see this man here, a pass, and I go, look at you, a pass, be your feet. And I got you. And then one day a man said, you know who that? And I said, no. Nah. You know, that fine, mother. 
the man who just walk beef with and gone on the bus and just gone on foreign. The man said, yeah, I saw the man who got a foreign. Uh, and I said, I want to be like them man. All the other man is famous and humble like that. I said, I saw the man famous and humble. And I said, yeah, hear yeah, me? And let me start to go on and go on and find myself now as a dope poet, Anya. And then I realized that the father that for the something, something, yeah. they in a good company then. I can't burn. So as we move forward, we just want people to know that a Jamaica say what? The youth them globally must know Oko Onura contribution to dog poetry. And right now, yes. So Rasada. Boy, I was talking earlier, oh you always come early. You just see that I'm brag about you, but I don't know if I maybe have some technical difficulties while I was coming. Transportation and so but they are right on time. Alright. So as we move, I want to call up one of the lifetime achievers, you know. I feel so. I could just dash it out. I know who ever call. Um, no more salary job. Yeah. So ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for our own lifetime achievement. Award is no other than Mr. Aljama. I'm going to present it to... And you go over to Mr. Ak and let him present that award to you? Yes. Yes. Yeah, yes, my brother. So this Lifetime Achievement Award is from A Time Rust Productions. And it is presented to my brother, Al Jam, for his contributions in the advancement of global reggae, dub poetry, art, roots, and culture. A Time Rust Productions Company presents this to you by Ras Atiba, December 2019. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Rasatiba. And as I was listening earlier, I, first I want to say congratulations to all the honorees earlier. Thank you. And as I was listening, and I said, recognition is such a powerful thing, and we don't do enough of it. You know, and for the effort that you put into this, it shows that the little saying that we say, it's better to give than receive. These things are so important. Because recognition, it, it touches your soul. And it wakes something up. And it, the, what I was feeling from each of the speakers tonight, in you know, just expressing themselves. You felt it. And that's what recognition does. So. You do, you're doing a great job, and I can see the 20th anniversary <laughs> coming soon. And of course, I'll be definitely continuing to broadcast it. Let, let, let me check. 20, 20 years from now, I'll be 72. So you have paid me still, man. Uh, okay. uh, you have like more than time. Double it up. Double it up. <laughs> Double it up. <laughs> so, you know, I want to thank you again. And musically speaking, as I'm a guitarist, I want to say, throughout the years in this community, I've seen musicians, but now I'm not seeing enough musicians. So if you have little children, what I would say, teach you know, give them a guitar, give them a keyboard, because we're losing that in our community. You know, especially like you see the full band with country and western, you see the full band with rock and so forth. But of course, the side effect of computer and technology tend to take away that camaraderie that a band can form. So if you have you, let them pick up an instrument, all right? Because I mean, the school curriculum, curriculum are not encouraging it as much. They'll put it in front of them more of a computer than an instrument. Yes, so again, I want to thank Sarah Bitter Movement, and I will continue spreading the good news, my brother. Thank Give thanks. Thank you. Well, we're going to ask Sister Ruth to come to the stage. Oh, one second, one second, before you, before, before you go. Folks, don't forget to check my lovely lady over there, Abby on the Garden of Jewelry, and 
All right? So check that out. And every Wednesday, you can check me out on 93.5 FM Green Zone Radio. Thank you. Awesome. Oh. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to ask Rootsy to come and to present this award with us to one of our special practitioner in the house. Okay, I'm gonna ask Van Allstar to join us on stage. Yes, he's there. Okay. Well, you see, you see Van Allstar is not like Ak, Al Jam, or so forth, right? Come over here, my brother. You, you, you love seeing a lot. Come right here. Are you? Are you? Step up. Step right here. Okay. So right now. This brethren, I truly I don't even know where I'm going. You see, for the weekend, is a radio personality. I don't want to name the reason because I'm not so good at names. You know what I'm saying? Uh, wait, 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 wait. We could get some, some silence. Huh? Please. We need some, some respect. Yes. We need some silence. Please, please. Yes. So, right now, Van, for the years I've been knowing, and come on to roots and culture, music. This Virginia, and so you look young, even not hard that young, I just you the pan inside, you know, see, because I'm a little bit of a I'm a little bit of a you understand me? So it's a blessed youth, you understand? Stop, stop it, stop it. It's a blessed man, you understand me? So here is our beautiful sister, Rootsy, she's gonna present this award to. Van Arstar. Yes, Rasta Tiba. Give thanks. Rastafari, everybody. Rastafari. Yes. Um, let me read this first. So, All Time Brass Productions Certificate of Excellence is hereby granted to Vaughn Arstar, aka Van Davis, for his contributions as a selector to the achievement of global reggae, art, roots, cu culture, and community service, Sarabita Masters Award 2019. Thank you. Thanks, Rasa for the love. Uh, I just wanted to say something, because I don't get an opportunity to do this very often. Vaughn is, I don't know if you, everybody here know me, but I'm Rootsy, all right? This is my husband, All Star, all right? And I'm very proud of him. Um, I have watched him for the last almost 14 years play music relentlessly, sometimes for no money at all, and um, but healing at the same time. Mm -hmm. I have seen people pass out, faint, catch the spirit, go mad when he's <laughs> playing music, <laughs> and <laughs> you know, a lot of people that see us together, they're like, "Wait." That ballad, right? You did. Yeah, right. And I'm like, this is the most rasta ballad on ever beaten up in And that's one of the reasons why I love him because he's doing a great community service. Because playing music, people think is easy. It's not easy. It takes a lot of love, and especially the type of music that he plays. His family calls him Bongo Man because they're like, can't you play dance hall? <laughs> like, we have to play them all through their way before he's born. You know, he's 40, 42 years old. Enough of the tunes that were my player way before he was even born. And the spirit of the elders definitely live amongst us because of what he's doing. He's paying tribute to the Russell community, to all communities, and definitely to enough elders and veterans that sang their hearts out from the 60s and 70s and their music could not even be played on the radio. And for a youth like this to be doing something like that, I can definitely tell you it's a very attractive it's very attractive. <laughs> and I'm very happy that he got this award, so enough respect um, and to all the Sarabita crew. And Vaughn, congratulations. I love you. Yes. 
One. All right, here we go. All right, greetings, everyone. Blessed be to all the animal forward out tonight. You know, it's a great moment. Boy, Rasa give thanks. Appreciate love, the eye gratitude. You know, I and I watch the eye for a long time. Enough times to see the eye in our shows. We used to come to you personally and beg you. The, you know, give me a, give me a poem for the night. And what we love about the Brethren is any rhythm we give him ride it as a top poet. You know, so. Big respect as a team and give thanks for acknowledging the hard work with I and I put in around here because like Roots has said, you know, me and one of the humble Rasta, one of the whole family, and everybody wonder why I take on to the vibes, but it's me, you know? Yeah, so give thanks to brother for the acknowledgement and give thanks to the whole community for supporting I for over 25 years, you know? Yeah, 25 years I and I play music. And I deal read around here. See, we start read a business from me at 12 year old. Yeah. See? Yes, I big up to Al Jam. We meet Al Jam all the way up in our up north somewhere from back in the early, early 90s. So big up yourself, Al Jam. We're glad to see that acknowledgement same way. So people give thanks to your support and your love and your gratitude. And you don't know I and I will there for more years. I play a roots and culture for the idea. Yes. Rastafari. Alright. Burn, burn it for them. Please step to the stage. Because uh, you're yeah, the fittest man for the car. We need them. We can't do it like you. We can't do it like you. I have to present this award to Oko. You know what I mean? Alright. Yes. Okay. Oko Onura. Mm. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Oko and Nora, dog poets globally watching. Oko is the first Jamaican to coin the term dog poetry. And what Oko has done for dog poetry, for I and I, and for the rest of I them, is wow. So before we take a burn shine, but no more than me, so take it away. Take it away. <laughs> um, <laughs> but I don't know. When you talk about a trailblazer, yeah. when you talk about a man who kind something from scratch, yeah, never exists before. Yeah. When you talk about a man who, yeah. you see, it, 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 well, I deserve a better mic when you talk about the great. <laughs> Nora <laughs> and the man who know Uko good call him Charlie. Allow me to tell? Not true. true. Yeah, man, call him Charlie. They meet Uko, I don't know, long, 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 long time. Your representation of Uko, so you sit right here. Yeah, so, <laughs> Sister Margaret Yasso, who Uko call her Auntie Margaret and the children <laughs> call her Auntie Margaret. Uh, I mean, no, I have no choice but for call her Auntie. <laughs> you see? So, Miss Ruby, I tell you that lady there. And, and Ben, I don't know if you said seriously, but that's why I said, give thanks to Mama Ruby. Mama Ruby. And I let out something out of the bag, you know, because I challenge my bridge to the bridge of my book or her poem called Ruby, my love, and I. And it is coming along quite slowly. And I'm hoping that by exposing it publicly, which I'm going to get cursed out, I know, <laughs> but it will speed it up. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for the dog poet extraordinaire, the great barefoot man who coined the term dog poetry. And the man who speak it all the while. So we're going to read this thing here from Ras Atiba and the Art Time Ras Production. This Lifetime Achievement Award is presented to Uko Unura for his contribution and pioneering role in the development of global dub poetry. A Time Ras Production Company, December. 2019 as presented from Ras Atiba through Ayman to Sister Auntie Margaret. <laughs> 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 
and on the behalf of Oko, Onora, pick up yourself, brother. So say something for us. Well, I'm not much of a speaker. Yeah. Good night, everybody, and thank you very much. It's well appreciated. And it's a great feeling to know that you're acknowledged while you're still here. Yes. And, yes. you know, not when you're gone, everybody is saying, oh, these are great poets, these are this, these are that. So thank you again, okay? You're not giving up poetry. You're not giving up poetry. So I can put your hands together for Auntie Margaret. Auntie Margaret. <laughs> Here for our brother Oko Onora. So put your hand again together. Grow up, all man. Yes. Give thanks. Okay. Yes. Why wow, this thing yeah. nice? <laughs> sweet. Okay. All right. Well, I want Richie Innocent to come up here and give. Rasada, this award, a Jamaica, you have a Jamaica and a, a, a dash out one. So give somebody a phone and make them do something around here because I saw it all. Rasada? Everybody have talent. Everyone okay. can use a legend hand. <laughs> okay. Ladies and gentlemen, this bridging here, Rasada, come over here, my brother. All right. Yeah. Come, can I write in the middle there? Okay. Come right in the middle. Right. All right. Hold it, Richie. Rasada, a target earlier, is a visual impaired dog poet, the first dog poet like this in the world. And I met Sada over nine years ago. And Sarah look at me, I said, I see it, man. You understand me? I'm always laugh when him say that because it made him feel it. And is it tonight? It's an honor. I want you to straighten up nice with them. I put your foot over here. You have, you have a good picture on here. You know? <laughs> <laughs> man, I want it, man. I want it, man. I want it, man. You stay there. You stop and you see. <laughs> You're in the business. <laughs> you see it. And the last time, Sada performed, said, Rasa Tiba. I want to have some different something. I said, what do you want to have some different something? I want to have some joke and all them things. I said, yeah, I said, yeah, go on, I said, yeah, move. So what do you mean I listen to one of them poems as I go to? I made the man, I go on, I put the blood. So I made the woman in the car, I drive the woman, I said, oh, that? And start to laugh. And I said, no other than a dog poet named Sada, you know. But you want to know with him? A tree named him alone have. You know what I'm saying? But Sada, what? Good morning. Good morning. Ras, Nasta. Three in one. <laughs> so, without further ado, I'm going to ask Rich Innocent to present this award to Rasad. A Time Ras Productions Certificate of Excellence is hereby granted to Rasad and Nasta, aka Gadomo, for his contribution to the advancement of global reggae and dog poetry sarabita masters awards 2019 i hereby present you with this award 2020 is division Greetings to my I loving <laughs> fellow brothers and sisters. Yes. Give thanks to everyone present in greatness. I invite some ones and ones and they are hearing present. Mama Deli, Brother Joe, that I know, and others. But I have to give thanks to this present moment in greatness that I can be at this point where I can stand and to receive such great award. It's an honor 
and a great privilege. Well, as Rasta Tiba said, I and the I met for nine years now, started another little place they call Greenleaf. So we're coming from a far away. And I know he's a great brother, so I call I salute him as a man with many hats, which the I may not know why I said that. Because why well, I drive camp in court people here. Yeah. Just see no man love money like you. Just me. Make it up. And I tell you, say, he's a great brother. You know, so I see where we have to be thankful and be grateful that you can have such great vision and to acknowledge. I and I works that we're doing for art, roots, and culture. So I'm so delightful. But first, they have to be thankful for who made I am possible to be a part of life journey that I can collect like award. Mama Deli, my mama, because I love you so much. <laughs> oh, you mean? You mean? I love the woman. Huh? So at this present moment, I have to be said, Glory be. And it couldn't be possible for us at Tiba alone to do what he's doing. You have to have somebody instrumental with him. And I always salute the queen. And I know of a lady, I call her Dates. <laughs> it's AKA Kasha. <laughs> you know? Period. Because she's very instrumental. Yeah, he couldn't do it by himself. Because when he come up with a name, a timer's production. I'm the first man in prison to him. I say, yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, so I am as a part of what Atiba is doing, and I give them, say, so bit of movements, and I see where we're going, great places. So thankful for this moment, Rastafari I love, to each and every one that is here, and to acknowledge the presence of Alan I. Vaughn, Yo. bless up yourself. Give thanks. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. And as we rule, I'm going to go to bubble, bubble natural level. Lord of His mercy. All right. Beautiful. Okay. Here what happened now? And the first. From the Sarabita Movement, a Time Ras production, is a certificate of excellence and it's hereby granted to Sunshine Heart and Bubba Natural for their contributions to the Sarabita Movement and to the advancement of global reggae. Sarabita Masters Award 2019 by Ras Atiba, founder of a Time Ras production, present this to you and you. <laughs> First and foremost, you know, we have to give thanks to the King Rastafari, you know. And it's a pleasure, you know, to see our beautiful people come out tonight and, you know, share the joy and the love with us all, you know. Yeah, man. Well, Rasta Tiba, now I have to give thanks, you know, because I want to tell you the truth. I had the one of the first man <laughs> who put a hip on stage and said, go sing Bobo Natural. <laughs> yeah, man. So I forgive thanks, you know. <laughs> yes, a giant from such time till now, you know. And I just keep going forward with it still, you know. Yeah, man. So I forgive thanks for the love and the joy, you know. Come on, go bless up yourself, you know. And to everyone, act big up yourself, you know. Enough love, you know. Yeah, man. Rasta. And bless you something. Greetings, Rastafari. Farah, that's the first blessing. Blessings. Um, I'm very honored tonight to uh, receive this award from Rastatiba. Um, I, I guess when I walked in earlier, 
um, I think it was Alja who was speaking about uh, being acknowledged and what it really does to one's spirit, you know, when you're acknowledged. And sometimes as artists pushing forward, you know, we see the Grammys and we see this and we see that, but let me tell you, Rasa Tiba, they sweet me more than a Grammy, so that's <laughs> Honestly, honestly, I mean, it, it really warms my heart and to accept this award with my King Man is really a blessing because, you know, um, on behalf of my King Man and the children, we are very, very excited. I mean, the youths are excited as well and, you know, in this day and age with the family being torn down the way it is, it's, you know, instrumental when you can stick together as man and woman, go through the little rough, then the little ups and the little downs and make it work for the youth them and the betterment of our community as a whole because it's not just about individual self. I think for so long we've been living for self. It's about time we start living for each other. And family is the instrument that is really going to make us see each other and love each other. So Rasa Tiba, I really do give thanks for this award. Rasta Father, blessings. So we are just name out some of the stars from the name. So this is Kalila Rose. She's not here. We can give her her award. And we have Empress Regina St. Martin and Empress Regina St. Martin received this award in 2017. And we have Key Vibes, aka Karen Brick Rose Morrison. And we have Megan Simon, Uncle Randy, and David Reed, a.k.a. We are also have a Lifetime Achievement Award that is presented to Carlton Livingston for his contributions to the development and promotion of Global Reggae, a Time Ras Production Company, honoring December 2019. And uh, what Osage for? Come here. Being serious take place a while ago. I have to acknowledge you for your, for your works. But you see, when we look, right, just so, we call your name earlier on and things like that. But it's like 
me left the the block of the yard. No, 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 no. The man never did read me by you, but Jerry, me by you, me have a poem, me say, me not care about them award, and I know me pride me. I got you, me mouth like a AK-40, said me be clothed Babylon, bumbo clad eyes. What's your Yeah, go. What's your <laughs> no, no, no. You see, a while ago, I act, you know, I'm here, act. Set up the things that I know. No, I know everything. Make act, you know. We have, we have, we have, we have plaque. And I like to say, we don't have plaque. We have, we have a plaque. You understand me? But what happened? I don't know what took place. Because I swear we had everything, you know, see, but what really happened now is that tomorrow, me personally, I go up on Facebook and present Osage for with my wife and yard, you know, see, because you hear me now, big and serious, these awards are from 20, some of them are from 2017, some of the people have never come forward and collect them. But we still uh, 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 me, me acknowledge them. You see, Osage Fo, one acknowledge Osage Fo in such a powerful way. Put your hands together for Osage Fo. And one of the reasons why we, we, we definitely give Osage Fo an award for him work, when we just come to this country, Osage for the first man came now I played on Atlantic and Third Avenue. I played them called tea, the Tea Party. And when time you go, I see Osage for them in a them full glory. We just sit back for months and watch the man them come and say, oh yeah, I say them thing yeah, go on up here. I don't think we can deal with them like that. You know, see, I'm up for them time, they were talking about 20 ideas and so forth. And tonight, we just want to eye them, put the hands together. In a seat and celebrate a sad for the contribution. And to, to, to be honest, and I must say, this was. From a over look. Oversight, mm -hmm. never a check, but earlier I swear I saw as, as a yeah, food yeah. car. We talk about you, ask me to call your name, I would speak about your eyelid, and then no one will look, me say, Minister Vibration. Can but, yes. King of Kings. You see? You see? I'm going to take a picture. I'm going to take a picture. I look forward. Good. Hold on now. Picture, no picture. Yes, picture. Yes, sir. You get it. Yes. No, it's them two man here who made the cider. And them man here hold down the dub poetry scene in a New York. In fact, would I say North America? I don't know about Canada too tough, but I know at least North America the States. Them two man here. No, I met Rasa Saji for many, many years ago. And he was getting an award. A man named Louis Marston, a journalist who writing at the Observer and the Gleaner and them thing that did I get a man an award. Them time that Dashi came ballet and low cut and thing and voilà. thing. And them time I meet the man. And then I start hearing the man named Rasa Saji Fu. Then I said, but Rasa Saji Fu, no, I'm ballet. <laughs> <laughs> You know, but just proud, proud to be in the company of them man. You see, when I go past man, I would have feel now, yeah? Man, I want to look good enough. Yeah. Hey, no. You I'll see? I'll one question. Then. Yes, King. What do you say, what do you say, Bali? Eh, eh. When you bring up a word, when you bring up a word, man. <laughs> because... <laughs> Everybody come up under the shame as his majesty in Palace. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So yes, sir. Uh, when you're a god ball. Mm -hmm. What's the difference, though? 
Well, you're uh, the boy out of Miami who ball, you know. So, <laughs> yo, it's not that, it's not, no, it's not discrimination. Yeah, no, man, there. It's just a, a recognition that a man. But you know, company cases come to life. Yes, sir. You understand? Yes, sir. Yeah, no, and we're not discriminate, you know. So, when my day off already, and my father, they are one, and they have to let go. Mm. And then pass away. So, Shame off my left. Ali, Ali. And me bury them with my body. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You understand? Yeah, man. So, so Give time. Ali, Ali. Bless. Honoring the elder. Man. I think. All right. So, but we just want to say thank you <laughs> to you, my brother, <laughs> for holding it down. And you, my brother, for holding it down. Same way. You see? Um, Rasta Sajifu is the man who is responsible for my stepping out again because I had walked away from this for about 32 years. Mm -hmm. Seriously, yeah. And this man yeah, put I for a man named Wayne, Wayne Russell. You used to carry I forgot MC if he show them and thing I was sorry for saying MC thing alone can't work, you know. You have something to say and you have come say. Yes, sir. I personally don't think that the fact that the, um, the plaque isn't here tonight is any big big thing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hero special it become now. He might go get film black and yeah. Rasa T by would drive character game. Yeah. Yeah. So we just wanna pick up the thing. I would just wanna say to all the cultural soldiers here tonight with us, we love you. You're doing a great job. Big tree grow from little seed and this tonight is the kernel of an international movement. And I feel it right as so. well. Give thanks. Yes, and thank you, brother. But I put on Facebook one day this week and I said, the, the brother here give me an award. I don't think that I deserve it because Babylon is still standing. You know? Uh, Uko sign up and say, if, we, if you have touched one person in the world, you know what I mean? You know, that is it, you know, and that, that's like, you know, because we run away from them things then, because we are, we are soldier, yeah. you know, we are soldier, yeah. all right? And I remember when the, the, the first award that you got there that night, if you can remember, even though I have blocks by my head, but I tell the people them, yeah. me I say Rasta from a long time, I, I said to the people them, say, look at little Jamaica, and we get such a vision. Must be a reason why we get that vision of this man. Must be a reason. You know? I'm here to tell you, say, Rasta, Barley, whatsoever, as long as you have God in your heart and the power of love in your heart. Alright? So, right now, we as Rasta people need to step up and start pussyfooting around. Yes, and Babylon, no nah, nah joke. Yes, Alright? So, this is what I say. The poem say, you never did read my bio, I say. All right, I'm a no key about an award and a Nobel Prize. I don't use my mouth like an AK 47 for clothes, Babylon, bum, buckled eyes. But at the same time, you have, you have to give, you have to be, you have to be thankful, you have to be grateful, you have to give, show gratitude when someone recognizes you. You know, I have traveled this world doing poetry and I'm. And I step off of the stage. I opened up Germany, I had Germany, and we go up on the stage, and I was afraid to, to lick them hard because I pay white people. So I did some little nice poem, you know? And then when I did, the white man walk over to me and said to me, say, The man went up, went down the stage, and did three of the most hardest revolutionary poems ever hear any white man read. And when he done, he said, Go back to New York and give him hell. <laughs> All right? And so this is why I do poetry. I am in Liberia, West Africa. And I'm on a club named El Mizan, and then a reggae, a reggae band is on the stage. I'm going to just show off to me at Jamaica. I'm going to go up and say, can I get the mic? Give me a tune, now. I'm going to drop a poem. And when I drop the poem, after I finish, the whole lady just walk, walk out of the audience and drop to her knees and say, thank you for bringing the message back home. Yeah. So when I have a hole, all of these things I have a hole on to. I'm in a Harlem. And in a supermarket, and a lady asked me for it. You just say something, and I just drop a poem for her. And I said, the lady said to me, say, me can't dead now because me know said you just make me know that someone is here to carry on. So we have work for do. Yeah. We have work for doing in the name of Jesus. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
So make some noise for Rasta Tiba tonight, one of the hardest working dumb boys. Don't yeah. make no mistake, don't make no mistake, brother. One love, one love, one love. Tell me what now. We're, we're gonna, based upon how we do the, the thing, we're gonna make, hello, my dear tea lady, B. <laughs> can you pass me the, the contribution bucket? <laughs> yes, so what we do, we don't charge at the door, but we ask people to donate as much money as possible. Okay, so go for the $20, the $50, the $100, and all them things, that are, and, and put it in. Yes. Yeah. So, I will ask the people to go down deep, this is, this is Christmas, and come up nice, and we have refreshments and so forth, and, 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 and we, have, we have live music, you know, we have the band is going to come up, and the band is going to play, and things like that, you know? So, alright, so, yes, yeah, so, we're asking everybody to just pass the, the bucket around, and just, yes. Everybody must put some money inside. Everybody must put money inside. Everybody must put money. Everybody must put money. Everybody. Everybody must put money inside. We don't charge up those who want people to, to, to give generously. Everybody. Everybody. Yes. Well, yeah. So take out the money out of and nice it up. Yeah. And we go along. So, so, the man, I'm going to come in and like that. So all of the awardee, yeah, all of the awardee, if you can come forward and we could take some pictures. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>
Selassie. You see tomorrow over Mega Everest at the same group. At the same group that Mega Everest tomorrow. So I'm come out to the Kwanzaa celebration tomorrow. Starting from 3 o'clock. And it's a group of musicians here. Are the greatest group of musicians coming together from several different groups coming together tonight to represent art, roots, and culture? Doggy Gutlas, Schematic, Alja Revolution, Lyndon, one famous man, the keyboard player, one famous man, guitar, our famous band. Yes, sir. All right. RCK 97. Uh, RCK 97. The musical group from Rockaway. We love Rasatima. Rasatima is the movement. All right. We were just like particles ready to, to jump over. Over the fence. Below, there are no lines. Below right? the Ula on the ground line. We have refreshment and still. I want to buy at the bar. Please, please, please. And if you to drive, don't drink. But if you to drink, don't drive. And drive, don't drink. Call out Uber.
sono Pozzul Lesso Yes Yes Yo, you see where I'm going now? Alright Alright Ross Ganimo Ganimo Come here You see, I want my people to come and watch you Come here Yes. Carry up here. Come on, Come on, Come on, Come on, Come on, Come on, Come 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 on, Come
of Global Reggae, Sarah Vita Masters Award 2019, Rasa Tiba Founder, Our Time Rasa Productions grants you this honor. Thank you, this is so We have to embrace life and to just be around so many, know so many of you for so many years. Ruth, Sivan, Rasa Tiba, it, it just goes on and on. And Al Jam, I'm so blessed to be in the presence of everyone and to be honored for the works that we do. That sometimes is very discouraging um, because we put forth so much effort and we feel that it's not being received, but with this, I see it's re received, and it's an inspiration to keep moving. So give thanks, I'll keep on. I want, I want to say, I want to say something special about this young All right. Like, Rasana, come right here, you, you need to talk. Come, come, Kalila Rose is here. All right. Well, Rasada, remind me about. Wallet, wallet, man. Father, 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 the bicycle, father. Yeah, man, everything blessed. Yeah, father. Everything blessed. One big clap, one big clap. All right, all right. Yeah, so, 
Rasada always talk about Carolina Rose all the time. in such a beautiful way. You remember Sada. you from Greenleaf days Sada. when you when you passed through and that was his first time coming to the Greenleaf open mic event. And the reason why we put the spotlight from Carolina Rose, to me, my estimate, my observation, if you have a Janine at uh, Jamaica, you're over Janine at uh, uh, Brooklyn, New York. <laughs> But we are saying, we are going to lift you up with energy and frequency and make you go there as a global ambassador for reggae music representing Brooklyn NYC. And you see, what we're doing here tonight, we're going to take the energy to our next level. You see, these are the musicians right behind us, they are going to work with me. You understand me? And if you promote the music to our next level, and matter about next, matter about money. We want to wait and somebody hire you, they might pay you five thousand dollars for perform. You always dress nice. You know, see, it's for real. That means you have the most of what I see you something around here. Vice, and vice nice. And, and vice nice. nice and everything nice. So what we are saying now, Kalila Rose, every time when you touch an open mic event, a level of professionalism is wow. And at that we are talking about now. Don't take nothing for granted when you come on to your art because they never can tell. You see them sitting there? We don't know who are watching them. You understand me? So they are serious. Yes, sir. And I try tonight. Yeah, try and, and tonight, when we honor this young lady, you have other people in our community where do like sister being in the sunshine and thing. But as we say, these ladies in our community, we have to start big them up and make them feel appreciated. You understand me? We have a dream. We have a dream. And we may talk about when we are keep our event and then say money, we we'll come out, we we'll tell our friend and speak highly and call the road. I want you to lead. Um, take up everything where you have can do. Make them know so you're bright. You understand me? <laughs> and all them things. You have to sell yourself. I'm a teacher. And all them things. Make them know. And if they want counseling, advice, tutoring, come to this multi talented artist around here. And believe me, my blessing is on you. And we're going to see you move yeah. from stride to stride. And Miss Kelly. I don't know if you're watching from Jamaica, Miss Ellie Skelly, but I know the rich innocent is definitely yeah. representing Miss yeah. Ellie Skelly. Yeah. So we have people from Jamaica definitely have to carry this energy back. So Carolina Rose, when you go to Jamaica and over yourself, you, you can go to a rich innocent and you get a personal interview from this mama. Because we now stop until every year. We have a speak, push speak. out a, a, a female and a male artist for zero. We're not the one who are abbies. We're the one who zero like her. The man always come out here tight and nice and speak. who goes again with the place. Uh, <laughs> Empress Sunshine and Bubba Natural. You can't go walking at them shoes as a couple. Nice. You understand? Nice. So, <laughs> Ras, Ras, Rasada, I know that you want to say something personally about. Sister Kalila, so you can go ahead and do it for us. We find out. Give me one. 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 Give me in time, I look a bit small, you know? <laughs> but we start out at one place, as I mentioned earlier, and in Greenleaf, you know, Rasatiba was just doing the honors of hosting the program, you know? And I came by with a brother named Rasatiba, called him Picturas, which is my fleshy Nagram. And I'm going to come and do a little vibration. Then I acknowledge this sister come forward and do a thing. So after she was leaving, I was outside at the door with the great Major Mackerel. And she stopped by and said, She never love me, I'm Kalaina. She can't tell you. 
<laughs> and she asked me to give her a name, but I was trying to come up with a name, but then later on I hear the rules from the Kalila, so it's so beautiful. So I know when she born in the music, and to take it, start to take it serious. Right at Greenleaf, she can tell you, that's where she, her career starts. So I know her from such time. And I give thanks that Asatiba see her growth and how she's been progressing and can salute her in this high regard. So I have not much more to say, but so more love and stay sweet and love that you will give us. Yes, it's a family. Mama Dele, brother Joe, I'm here to love everybody who may invite you. Know, there's nobody else there, but. <laughs> everybody else. <laughs> Why? <laughs> love God, man. But no love is one thing. Me and I'm just happy with that. That's a type of Tiba we talk about it because you know me to hurt. That's the fun. Give that. Yes, so. So you, 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 you don't know. So you take some pictures, please. You take some pictures with us. You understand me? All the time, so take pictures. Come to me. I want this nice, beautiful bubble. You don't mind? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So you want to post some pictures for you to see. And this is the whole energy we want to create. I'm mm -hmm. glad that Sister Kalila could make it and things like that. Of course, I wouldn't miss it. You understand me? Yeah. And the energy was. Just bubbling up, bubbling up, bubbling up, bubbling up, and uh, we just feel good to know that we are celebrate our own, and we are going to do it next year. We want to do the same thing for being the Ayata, being the Safari, because she's been doing a whole lot of work. But as I said, we are doing it in order. Kalila was here with us for over nine to ten years. The Libby kid come to Sarabita and carry a band and come perform free for us, reduce the price when we will their ask for. Yeah, hear me? A few people about you have them a level of generosity. And from them time, they must should love it. But here what happened to us around the world to start now. You see, when we are in Jamaica, and we used to have Kalala Road and perform, we go to Buckle, we go to Stone, we go to Pan, we go to Mount, and when they say, Kalila Rose, what we say? Yeah! I'm bigger up like David now tomorrow. If we not do it, nobody is now do it. And she's super talented. Me, I tell you that. All right. And see right now, we're going to make all of them. They're going to laugh about. Let me see. Let me see one time we have. We only have eight minutes. To, to the live music, so I'll jump and dug it. We can go and bounce and then we have refreshment over here and then we'll call it a beautiful day. So we have to